so it's um it's monday it's monday night actually i haven't done much today um started work walked to work went to work came home from work had something to eat and just been watching uh another part of friday the 13th uh almost on one friday movie a day um just finished part four uh the one with tommy jarvis um, you know Corey Feldman doing uh, doing his thing, uh, and it's it's the first one that really covers zombie Jason. Um, you know all the rest were kind of oh my god how is he still coming, and this one is oh my god he's back from the dead consistently. Um, plenty of tits and ass though. Uh, probably one of the most of of things so far um, but going through them um, really want to try and get all of them watched by at least the end of the weekend um, because it's actually slowing me down for some of the other horror stuff I want to watch so watching um, watching Friday the 13th and watching all of them and also looking on YouTube and seeing the um, the films uh, and walkthroughs of the old Friday the 13th game made me think about um, about how a Friday the 13th game could run at the moment. Um, obviously, you couldn't have the character playing Jason. As fun as that would be, that would be a good bonus map, downloadable content, um, you know, stalking around the place. Um, however, if you, if you consider um, all of the plots tied together, and then consider how um, Batman Arkham Asylum as a gameplay where you could go around the entire island. Um, and then consider the, that you could have the actual camp, Crystal Lake, uh, Higgins Haven, and the Jarvis household. And just go from place to place to place um, around the lake and just say that the lake was the central point. Um, and you had to do things like rescuing in different areas. Um, it, it could, it could work. It wouldn't be so so good a game, but it'd be a nice, cheap, fairly simple one to uh, to make. Um, and cinematics will be brilliant. Um, but then again, the original um, Friday the Thirteenth game was shockingly bad. Um, just the same as the original Nightmare on Elm Street and the other um, Nez and those era games were shockingly bad um, it would still be better than E.T. Um, there is not really that many games that are not better than E.T. so good news and bad news for people who go to Burger King the bad news first the angry whopper has sadly passed um, those who don't know that was the whopper with um, jalapeno peppers and onion strips it's now been replaced with the double caesar smoked angus burger um, which is the one with um, cheese and onion strips and bacon not as good but the good news chili cheese bites are back jalapeno and cheese in batter it's damn good and I'm so glad to see it back so that that's good news because I love jalapeno peppers I've really gotten to enjoy them and the only other place that really does them for any sort of good quality is Subway um, steak and cheese with jalapenos beautiful okay I have a favor to ask um, there are a few people who will know this um, I would imagine if he's watching Deej will know this um, but there might be others who are seeing it and who would have a good idea. I want to know good, fairly good horror movies starring a crocodile. Uh, I'm aware of uh, Crocodile. I don't know whether it's a good movie. Uh, Lake Placid, I haven't had a chance to see that one yet. Uh, and Black Water, I think, is the other one, which is an Australian. Um, what are they like? Are they good? Let me know. Um, really, really need to know if there's any more. Um, crocodile, not alligator. That's the important thing. Crocodile, not alligator. So, let me know. Want to hear from it. 
Um, we'll tie into something later, I hope. Okay, so one of my friends actually asked me um, why I haven't used my webcam from my video recently. Um, it's actually because of the state of my room. If I use the one that's on my computer, my actual computer is in my room. Um, and the state of my room would therefore be picked up. And I'm going to show you this because this is this is going to be disturbing enough. Um, so I'm going to I'm, I'm just going to show you because I haven't done much Halloweeny stuff. So consider this: what a wasteland would be like. Post-apocalyptic. Yeah. Yeah. Yep. 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 Yep, yep, and of course the greatest t-shirt ever. But yeah, now the reason for this, and there is a reason, it's not a very good reason, um, is that for the last several months we've been looking at whether or not we're going to move out of here. Um, we finally decided we're not going to move out of here, but I might be moving myself. Um, and it seemed a bit stupid to kind of pay any attention to putting anything that much away. Unfortunately, what it meant was um, that clothes wise, I didn't bother with that either because summer stuff was going to become winter stuff, so summer stuff would end up being packed away. Um, as for my bed, it's because I'm lazy and I haven't actually sorted it out since I got up this morning. Um, got up and had to go straight into work because I overslept. Um, so yeah, it's, it's a hell of a pigsty in here. And that's the reason why I haven't been using the, uh, webcam on the computer. And now you know, and knowing is half the battle.